All right, just a quick little video here. I have seen so many issues where in iRacing, people's force feedback has just stopped working. Happened to me a couple of times uh, over the last few days with just getting into a race. It'll be fine in practice. It'll be fine in qualifying. But then I jump in the race and there's nothing. Uh, it's also happened to me before with um, in the middle of a session, just driving and all of a sudden, nope, no force feedback. It's a super simple fix. I've seen a lot of people be able to fix it. Um, but this is our, uh, you know, this is the forums. If you're an iRacing member, check out the forums. There's always something uh, in there to check out, whether it's schedules, any of that kind of thing. I saw this post uh, from iRacing staff, and they tell you all how to do it. And I'll show you real quick. It's super simple. It looks a lot more <laughs> complex. Um, but all you have to do is in your search bar down at the bottom, you just want to click, type in services. It's going to pop up this window. And what you're going to want to look for in this whole list here is you want to scroll down to game input. Do, 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 do. Game input service. You want to right click and hit stop. That's all you got to do. You might want to restart your wheel. Uh, for me, I have a Thrustmaster TMX force feedback, so all I have to do is unplug it, plug it back in. iRacing will, you know, lose it and then re, you know, pick it up and that kind of thing. Um, and you'll be all set. There is a way to turn that off permanently. Uh, you want to go to Properties, and you'll see Startup Type. And you want to set that to disabled. This way it will not turn back on. You want to hit apply, hit OK. And that's all you have to do. It's just set up as disabled. It's not going to start up anymore. And in theory, you won't have to worry about force feedback just dying out on you. Leave a comment below. Let me know if that helped you, if you have any questions, anything like that. I'll also link this post in the description below as well. Um, you know, if you, this was helpful, feel free to give it a like, subscribe, you know, all the stupid YouTube stuff. Um, really do appreciate it, and hopefully I'll see you out there on the track. Thanks for watching.